So this is day two. I'm going to be taking you around the ship today and show what's on offer and also let you know why we were delayed into Amsterdam and we do get a little sneaky peek into Richard's rooftop so stay with us for that. So good morning is our first day on Resilient Lady and where are we going Mike just for a quick coffee? The galley. The galley that's right because we're booked in for brunch at Razzle Dazzle so we just uh, want a coffee and maybe a little pastry just to put us on. Hi. We're just going around to see what we've got for breakfast. Lots of fruit here. Go through that door there. Yeah. Mm, they look nice. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. We have the bento boxes. Yeah, Things like mixed berry. <laughs> Carbonated drinks. It's <laughs> obviously very busy this morning because it's our first day on our trip. We've got brunch book, so we're only having a coffee and a little pastry just to see us through. We've also got cereal, only condiments. So we're just having a quick pastry as we're going to brunch. Razzle uh, dazzle. Razzle dazzle, of course, past half eleven. Uh, so what have you got there? So we do ready made. Breakfast croissants, bacon, egg, and cheese. Nice. Lovely that. And and snack. Pan of chocolate. I just put me on for an hour or so. This is the Sip Champagne Bar. It's a gorgeous little bar, but in the day you can grab a coffee here or a champagne if you wish and watch the world go by. It's just a little bit more chilled than the galley. It's on deck seven. So this is the groupie. So this is where you can have a karaoke room. Sign up here. Possibly is just a small one for two or four. Four eight. to six. Oh, four to six, is In it? Here. Yeah. This one's called the pink room. Oh, this is cool, isn't it? If you fancy this with a gang of you while you're on, it's the purple room. Someone in there. Oh, yeah, listen. <laughs> We've already posted a vlog of our Razzle Dazzle uh, brunch. It has got lots more details in, in this video, so if you're interested to see what we ate there, just click into our playlist and you'll be able to find it. Weather's perked up, it's really hot. I've got my sweatshirt on and I need to take it off because it's <laughs> unroasted. Just going through the locks now into the docks system. Hopefully there's no one stopping us going through.
more of the law ahead of us. And currently the local law enforcement is working on the yeah. So this may take some time. Unfortunately, when we arrived, there were protesters. They were sorry, apparently. It took the authorities about two, two and a half hours to finally move them on, and then the dock gate was opened, and we were able to sail up into Amsterdam. Over the coming weeks we will have a separate video of the test kitchen showing each course in detail and what we thought about it. So if you want to see that, please subscribe. So tonight we're in the test kitchen, which is a little bit different than a normal restaurant. This is the food that we're having. It's very basic. It just tells you what it is and then we'll just see how it actually comes. So yeah. That looks my favourite already. Smells so good. Yeah, it does, yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. No, she turned at the beginning, it's amazing. If you like this video, then please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos. Uh, that was our meal with Paddy in the test kitchen, we really enjoyed it. So if you're on board, any of the versions of this, I highly recommend it. In our next episode, we're in Amsterdam, but before that, we have brunch at the wake, before exploring the canals of Amsterdam, and then in the afternoon, we're back on board and we enjoy the sunshine and the food and drink at the dock. And later on, Mike definitely takes the dip on Scarlet Night. <laughs>